liquefied petroleum gas, which has been on the increase also for five months. One kilogram of LPG has shot up to one city three pesos, representing a 21% rise. Now, this, according to the Chamber of Petroleum Consumers, Ghana, is defeating government's efforts at increasing LPG penetration. The past five months has seen LPG prices increase by some 21%. That is worrying. In a country where you're expecting LPG uh, penetration uh, to now take over from charcoal and firewood uses, which we say pollute the environment, uh, we are one of the few places where LPG is this expensive. Today, as we speak, LPG on the open market is even selling higher than your regular petrol and diesel. And we think that the government would have to take a second look at this. Uh, the finance ministry, the energy ministry, would have to take a second look at this. When we probed, what we are getting is that even the gas that we are taking from Atuabo, the locally processed gas, is somehow more expensive than what the BDCs are importing into the country. We expect Atuabo to be much more efficient. Instead of taking advantage of the zonalization policy just to price the gas, sometimes way beyond what the imported LPG prices are, we expect that uh, authorities will take this up. It shouldn't be said that because of the cost of LPG, the gas recirculation program that the NPA and government want to embark on uh, collapsed even before it got started. Because today, at six cities per kilogram, what it means is that if you have to get the regular 14.5 kilograms uh, supply, it might be a little above ordinary pockets. 